So guys, welcome to this whole team winning Getting Started Strong call. Um, Amy Turner and I are very excited to be sharing with you some absolutely amazing golden nuggets uh, to give you a fast start to the month, whether it's your start to the business, whichever it is. Um, it's always excellent to have a really good start to the month by getting into a good mindset. So just first of all, if this is your first ever Getting Started call, we are really excited to welcome you um, to the call, but also to the team. We are a group of heart-driven like guys and gals that want to basically you know, live a free lifestyle with you know, time and money freedom to do the things that we love and that we want um, in life without having to struggle without any question with being able to do what we want and juice plus is a way that you can do that we've got a vehicle to give you an opportunity to actually step into any life that you want it's really incredible so first of all before we get started as a team and as an individual i want you to have a think about what you want to achieve like what would your absolute dream look like, dream life look like if don't don't think about money Think about what things you would be doing because the thing is when, when we're thinking about what we want to achieve and what we want to manifest into our lives, what's really important is to think about what we want to feel and what we want to experience through being able to earn the money. So yes, an amount of money is a really nice thing, but actually what is that going to bring you? What What is freedom? What does it mean to you? What are you going to do with your time? Where are you going to be? Who are you going to spend your time with? Because that's the thing that if we focus on it, it will come bright and it will attract it into our lives. So think about how you're going to spend your time, where you're going to go, you know, what, what difference would that extra money make to you each month? Um, and get specific about it. Don't just be like, oh, I want to go on holiday. Where do you want to go on holiday? How long do you want to go on holiday for? What airline do you want to fly with? What economy do you want to sit in? What um, seating do you want to sit in? Um, you know, just get really, really specific and imagine it and feel it and really start to know exactly what you want. So having a goal and a vision is so important in this business, guys, because if you don't have a goal and a vision, how do we know where we're going? So my first thing to get you to write down today is July. What do you want to achieve for July? So it's again, it's important to get really specific. And if you want to share it in the chat of what you want to achieve in the month of July, um, yes, Amy, first class all the way, um, just in your comments. Um, yeah, like to share with everybody because again, like one of the main things when we're talking about goals and manifestation and what we want, we need to share what our goals are with people, whether it's one or two or whether it's a, something that you share with the, the team, it's, it's going to come true if you share it and you speak it out there. So whatever you want to achieve for July, pop it in the chat if you want. So get specific. So how many teams do you want? How many customers do you want? And then you can get even more specific. What kind of customers do you want? Do you want premium capsule customers? Do you want shake customers? How many of each? Um, and how many team members do you want? And then think about where you're going to find those team members. What groups? What, what groups do you regularly hang out in on Facebook? Because the things that you're most interested in, the four things I want you to think about that you're most interested in. So mine would be something like um, gym, um, Bali, Chango in Bali, I'd be in, in Bali groups. Um, I'd probably be in healthy food groups. I would be in, oh my goodness, what else? What other groups? I mean, I can't think of the top of my head. Like dogs, I love dogs, dog groups, I'm in dog groups. Um, and gym groups because I love the gym. So they're the kind of groups that I would go and hang out in. I'll give you an example. I'm in a group called Women Who Love Weightlifting. Um, and I go and create um, some posts in those group and people begin to know who I am. So I start to create a community around my posts. So I ask questions, I post value, and people then start to know who I am. And through doing that, people actually send me friend requests and want to be my friends. So, in that way, then I'm not going out searching for people to add to my Facebook. Okay, so that's a really great way for you to find people that relate to you, that want to be your friend. So think about what value that you can be adding into groups. Um, and it doesn't have to be like, you know, you need to know loads of informative stuff. Just little tips here and there about different things that you're interested in can be, um, you know, really a really great way for you to attract people that are in your tribe to be to, to become your friend. I just went on a massive tangent there, guys, sorry. But groups is a really great way to find people. Um, so, 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 um, number one thing in this business, guys, is to be a product of the product. We all know that the products that we have within Juice Plus are absolutely incredible. It's a no-brainer that the more products that we are on, 
the easier it is to share them with people. You know, I remember when I first started the business and I got on the capsules, I didn't really share the shakes because I didn't really know what they did for me. I didn't know what they tasted like. Then as soon as I started taking the shakes, I was like, oh my God, these are amazing. Like I love them. And I started posting about them as well as my capsules. And I started to get capsule and um, shake sales as well. So think about what products that you're on and then make it part of your goal to invest back into your business to get onto more products. So being a product of the product is absolutely fundamental. You know, if you don't want to be on the products, then there's absolutely no point you've been in the business. We are all about sharing um, products through recommendation for our health. It's so, so, so important. So it's a great thing to be clued up about nutrition actually as well, guys. So if you're sitting and you're thinking, oh, well, I don't really know, I've got some good little tips for you to go and look up on um, YouTube and Google of how to swat yourself up with um, Juice Plus and nutrition. So for those of you who don't know who Dr. Mitra Ray, so M-I-T-R-A Ray, Dr. Mitra Ray, um, she is somebody who is a uh, biochemist and she thrives about Juice Plus. She's, she's got some great information on her website. Um, if you go to YouTube, type in how Juice Plus is made, That'll show you a really cool three minute video. I think that thinks three minutes perhaps just exactly how Juice Plus is made. Thanks Ames for typing that in the comments. Um, that's Juice Plus. That's another really great video about all the products that we've got and about the business as well. You can follow people on YouTube as well, which is really great. And someone to follow on Facebook is someone called Matthias Mildenborn. Mildenborn? Mildenborn. <laughs> I can't remember how to say his name. Um, but babe, if you could type that into the comments as well. Um, yeah, Dr. Mitra Ray is incredible. She will help you learn a lot on um, the different products. So, um, yeah, there's so much you can learn out there. Um, go to YouTube and follow the actual official Juice Plus channel. And there's loads of studies that you can read up about. Go to the website. So it's up to us to learn about Juice Plus. It's our business. So it's really important to educate ourselves. So when people ask us questions, if we don't know the answer, we can say, do you know what? I've got some really cool information on that. Let me go away and find it. And then I can let you know exactly what that's all about. And so you don't have to say to people, oh, you know, I don't know the answer. Just say, do you know what? I've got some really cool information that I've got on my computer. Let me go and um, check it out and I'll forward it on to you. So basically then you're covering yourself and you can go and teach yourself at the same time. And if you don't know anything, you can ask an upline. So being a product of the product for me is absolutely number one. Ames, I don't know if you want to add anything to that. No. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. All right, babe. Well, I'm going to pass over to you, um, and then I'm going to come back and talk about some other little things as well. Um, do you want to share about the things that we talked about before as well? Um, what am I talking about um, now? I'm talking about the yeah, <clears throat> yeah, that bit. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Sorry, I did a few minutes something else. Yeah. So, um, hi everyone. So. Basically, guys, to get started strong in your business, um, you need to have a daily method of operation, which is a DMO. Now, this is going to be like your best friend in your business because this is going to be like your daily checklist of the things that you need to do daily in your business to grow your business and to share your products and your business with other people and to help other people and to share your mission of inspiring healthy living around the world, which is what we are all about. So your DMO, I know that we've got a whole nother call that really kind of goes into more depth about your DMO and what I'd recommend to do is to, you know, speak to your upline and find out more about that and, you know, what suits you. But basically what you need, I'm just going to cover like a very, very simple DMO, um, is obviously you want to be adding new people every single day to your network. So when you first start in the business, it kind of can be a little bit daunting to to add people that maybe you don't know. Um, so it's really important to get your head around that, um, you know, you need to be adding new people to your network every single day. You might have maybe 600 or a thousand Facebook friends at the moment, you know, maybe go and have a little look actually. Why don't everyone just go and have a little look and see how many Facebook friends you've all got um, and actually put that in the chat. Um, Cause it's really interesting actually to track how many friends you have. Um, because I think when I first started this business, I had about 600 Facebook friends. Now I've got 5,000. So it's really important to um, 
expand your network every single day. Um, I've been doing the business now for six years and every single month I always get new customers and new team members. And the reason for that is because I consistently add people through my daily method of operation every single day. So you can choose how many people you want to add. You might want to choose to add five people a day, 10 people a day or 50 people a day. And I know that some people in the team who are really relentless and really going for it, um, who are a bit more, you know, maybe been in it a bit longer, add a hundred people a day. So you choose a number, um, you know, that suits you and you can maybe discuss that with your upline. Um, and the great thing about this is that it's your business and you get to choose what you put into it. But obviously the more you add, the more you do with your DMO, the better the results you're going to get. Um, and it's quite nice because you can actually start a little bit smaller. You can start by adding five people a day and then you can build it up. But you want to be making sure that every single day you are definitely expanding your network um, every single day. And you can do this really simply. You can do this by going to groups, a little bit how Millie explained with, um, you know, think about what your interests are and what your hobbies are. So, um, you know, if you're like for me, I'm into horses, I'm into the gym, um, I've got a pug, um, I like traveling. So I'm in all those sorts of groups and, you know, so you can kind of do like how Millie explained earlier and you can, you know, be a voice in that group, post about the gym, post about your horses, post about your pug, um, ask questions. Obviously, you know, we can't post about juice plus in the group, but what you can do is use it as a community to find other like-minded people just like you. Um, you know, and those people that like and comment, on your picture of your pug you can add them all as friends and what you know like like what millie said you might even get people adding you as well so um you know and then what you can actually say is when when you then add that person you can say you know thanks for commenting on my picture of hugo like in eat well cute like i thought i'd add you like what pug have you got and you just it's just about expanding your network um, with other people that are like you other people that have similar interests something that you can you've got something that you can build like a rela <clears throat> a relationship on hold on so that's adding um you can also like add friends or friends you can actually go to like their profile picture and sort of add the likes and add the comments um, maybe you've got a few friends on your Facebook who is like totally someone who's like you and you can go and add their friends. That's also a great way. Um, but there's, there's a few other different ways you can, you can add. Um, but obviously like ma mainly the groups is the main way and friends of friends is really awesome, but you want to be making sure, like I say, that you are adding every single day and you can choose how many that you want to go for. Um, and a great way to think about, adding what I'm just going to finish on is it's a bit like giving out your your little business leaflet your little business card because then what they're going to do is they're going to come and check out your your profile and see what you're about and see you know they're going to scroll down and this is where posting comes in so posting super super important because they're going to start to see what it is that you're about are you someone that maybe they'd, they'd want to be friends with you know are you positive are you um you know, make it a good impression. Are you adding value? So what I mean by that is, you know, if they come to your profile and they're not seeing that you're really doing anything, then they're, they're not going to know that you're doing anything. So what I mean by that is you want to be making people aware that you are taking a product and that you are part of the business and that you're um, on, on your journey and you're sharing your life, you know, so you want to be making sure that they're aware that you are doing something without obviously ramming it down their throat. You know, it's not about becoming a juice plus sales page. You are still you, but you know, I always share daily that I take my capsules. I have my shake. Um, you know, I share my life and obviously I have been doing it for six years. So don't sort of compare, um, your chapter one with my chapter 50. So just remember that I started off just like you. Um, I, I had 600 Facebook friends. I didn't know how to post. I didn't know how to do all of that. But the great thing about this business is that you can learn as you go and that you can actually earn whilst you learn. So just remember to just take that next step and it's really simple. So with posting, um, you know, like I've just explained, make sure that you're showing that you're taking your, your products and it's all really down to kind of inspiring healthy living. So, you know, share that you're on the plan, the shred 10 plan or what plan that you have. 
share that, share your recipe, share that you're drinking more water, um, share that you're having the product, share that you're on this Zoom call right now, all those sorts of things, just share your life. But again, if you want more help with posting, we can go into detail more on that and um, you know, another time and you can speak to your upline. Um, and then really it's just about speaking to people about the products and the business. Um, you know, actually getting in the inbox and having conversations with people and actually asking people, you know, would they be open to checking it out? Would you be open to checking out more information, you know, on how you can earn an extra income? You know, I'm, I'm looking for new brand ambassadors, um, you know, who also want to inspire healthy living around the world. Would you be open to checking that out? And that really is as simple as it is, you know, adding, making sure that you're posting consistently, you know, at least, at least a minimum of three times a day, obviously posting to your story as well. Um, the great thing about the story as well, actually, is if you work in during the day of an evening, you can just post, post a load of things onto your story onto an, of an evening, because then it stays up there for 24 hours. And then the next evening you can then post up for the day what you've done. Um, so if you struggle to like post throughout the day, at least on your story, of an evening or in the morning, you can post quite a few bit of content up and it stays up there for 24 hours and then do the same again. Um, get yourself into a routine. Um, so yeah, so that's it. So add in, post in, and then just making sure that you're sharing the products and the business with people every single day. Um, that's just like a really simple, really basic DMO. There's extra things that we can do that we can teach you and we can show you, but this is just about getting started and keeping it dead simple. Um, and if you've got any other questions about the DMO, um, then obviously just speak to us or if you've got any questions, stick it in the chat um, or you can speak to your, your mentor who brought you into the business to help you more with that if you've got any questions. So is there anything else, Mills, that you want to add on to that simple DMO? Um, so, yeah, I just think the, the secret in that is being consistent, guys, with your DMO every single day. So Amy's obviously touched upon, you know, what a simple DMO is to get started. So absolutely everybody, um, if you want to be successful, um, that's something that we believe that you need to be doing every single day. And if we look back, like, I can't remember how many years ago it was now, um, when Amy and I changed our businesses, when it all when, when it all went crazy, um, it was because we implemented the DMO and we did it, we did it consistently and we started a 90 day game plan. So what we want to invite you to do is join the 90 day game plan that we started yesterday. So if you've not jumped on board with that already, don't worry, it's not too late. Come and join us from tomorrow, your tomorrow. Um, your day one would have been today actually, sorry. It's just because I'm a day ahead here in Bali. Um, so yeah, what I'd invite you to do is come and come and do a DMO for 90 days as an absolute minimum um, to get some momentum, to get some consistency. You know, if you wanna if you want to be successful, you've gotta treat it like a business, right? You've gotta be waking up every day and doing the small tasks like Amy's just talked about every single day to make that momentum. And it's just like that airplane that Amy was talking about on the call. You know, it's, it's not about like, you're gonna do a couple of things and it's just gonna take it off like that. It's gonna take time to get it up off the ground and that's exactly how this business works. So yeah, amazing, amazing input there, Ames. Thank you so much. Even I've, I've written some notes down, thank you. So um, DMO is so, so, so important. And obviously Amy was talking to you about um, asking questions and then asking people about if they'd be open to watching a video or um, what I like to say to people is, I don't know if you'd be interested in making an extra income. And they'd be like, yeah, okay, so what, what's that all about? And then I would say, would you be open to watching a video? And then you're probably like, well, where do I add them to? So we've got an incredible system. Um, it's a simple system that we've implemented into the business and it's, it involves three different groups. So we have now an opportunity group, which is called the Dream Team Opportunity. And what you can do is you can add your people into this group and tag them in the opportunity video. So it's all done for you. It's really, really simple. So all you need to do is go out there, find people, talk to them, relate to them, and then ask questions, just like that one I just mentioned, and like the ones that Amy said earlier. Tag them in the video, and what you wanna do is ask them to pop you a message once they've watched the video. And then what you can do is ask them what they liked about it. And then say, for example, they're like, oh, well, I love the fact that you can work from anywhere. I love the fact that you can fit it around what you do or um, you can fit it into the nooks and crannies of your day. Like it's a part-time business opportunity that you can work from your phone. I love that I can do it around my busy schedule. You can relate to that. So yeah, me too. Like, isn't it great that you can you fi figure it around everything that you already do and just really relate to them. 
and get on their level. And then you can say to them, on a scale of one to 10, how ready would you be to get started in the business? One being not ready and 10 being started. And then when they say like a seven or an eight, you can say, great, so what would make you a 10? And they'll say, well, I need to ask my husband or they'll say, um, I need to know more about the products or they'll say, I want to learn more about how you get paid. And then obviously we can go away and give them that information. And then we can say to them again, so on a scale of one to 10, now I've given you the information about the products. Um, whereabouts are you on that scale to get started? And they'll say, yeah, well, a 10, I know everything I need to know. And you feel like, great, let's get you started. And it's that simple. So then once you've got your, um, your, your people started and they've, they've been through the opportunity group and they've said yes to the opportunity. We've got an incredible group, which we also talked about the other night on the call called Getting Started Strong. And I'm not gonna go through it again because all the information is plain and simple, it's there for you, but the group is there for you to be um, taught on how to work this business when, from the first day that you start. And what you need to do is work through the six steps. So it's like um, using your office, talking about products, how to speak to people, business, launching your business, um, following up. It's all the really basic things. So what you want to do is work through those steps and help your team members work through those steps as well. So it's a, it's a foolproof system, guys. It's really, really simple. And it's there for you to be able to make this business even easier than it already is for you guys. Okay, it's a really simple system and we've been using it. And I think, you know, it's something that's going to create a lot of success. And I know the people that have been using it have been loving it. Um, so yeah, that's, it's a really great system to be using. So it's a simple system. Um, it's an opportunity group, getting started group. Um, and then once your new team members have got themselves to DD, then what we can do is we can do a launch call with them, um, a launch live on, on their Facebooks, and then you can add them into your team group. So they've got some success and then you can add them into your team group. So it's all about building relationships, guys, like Amy was saying. So think about what questions that you can ask people. You know, what difference would 200 pounds make to their life? Um, you know, what, and if you're talking about health products and how many fruit and vegetables they eat, you know, how much money a week do they spend on junk food? That's a really great question to ask people when you're talking about the products. And what we can say is, well, if you want to earn some extra money and you want to get some results, what we can do is cut out all the junk food. And actually, if you're spending five pounds a week, that's 20 pounds a month. You know, and if, you want, if you're willing to spend a little bit more, we can get you on a really great package to help you feel amazing and then to be able to sign up to the business to share people your results. So it's just a really great way to ask questions to find out what people want. But what's really important is to know what you want when you're starting this business. So I've got five questions that all of you can ask yourself. So if you get a piece of paper and a pen, if you haven't already, and you write these questions down, and what you can do is you can share them with your upline um, because, and this will just help you know exactly where you're at. So question number one, you can ask this to your new team members as well and to yourselves. So what caught your attention about joining the business? What made you say yes? So what caught your attention and what made you say yes? So for me, when I said yes to the business, it was because I felt like I wanted to help other people feel as good as I did. And I thought if these, if these guys from America who were in their like late 50s, early 60s can earn $10,000 a week with Juice Plus, I was like, if they can do it, I can do it. That's what caught my attention. And I was in a state of desperation of living in my overdraft, hating the job I was in. So I just kind of had a what if moment. So ask yourself, what caught your attention about Juice Plus and what made you say yes? Question number two is, how much would you like to be earning per month, three months from now? So how much would you like to be earning per month, three months from now? And everybody can answer this because we can all move forward. Um, and it, what it really does, it gives us some time to be able to focus on the consistency of our DMO, of us taking our product, of us speaking to people, and to give us a goal to work, work towards. Okay, so question number three, how much time per day do you have to put into your business? Now, this is a really great question. So how much time per day do you have to put into your business? This really makes you think, because if, you, if you're saying to your upline that you wanna earn a grand a month, but you're saying, yeah, I've, only, I've got like an hour, an hour a day, 
you need to be doing some serious connecting in that hour if you want to be earning a grand a month. So it's, it's perfectly doable, but over time, you know, that, that can happen. But in three months, you might need to amp that up to two or three hours a day, you know, to be connecting with people, doing income producing activities. So everything that Amy talked about on that DMO is what we call an income producing activity and we call it an IPA. So ask yourself again like every day, like how many income producing activities are you doing in that hour or two hours or three hours that you've got? Because it's not just about sitting and scrolling, it's about actually doing um, accountable tasks that is gonna bring you income. So connecting with people. Really guys, this business is simple. It's about talking about the product and talking about the business and inviting people to opportunity calls um, and to opportunity, the opportunity group and sharing what we do, okay? So question number four is what events are you going to get to? Because we all know guys that going to events is where the magic happens in this business. You know, this is actually a mini event. A Zoom call is a mini event. Um, having a one-to-one -one is an event. So whether it's with a customer or a team is an event. But think about what events that you're going to go to to benefit your business. So what online events are you going to show up to? The Diamond Dreamers have an opportunity call every, um, it's normally Thursday, guys, but this week it's a Wednesday due to some commitments that I've got. Um, and the, the Dream Team have got a, a opportunity call every um, Tuesday. John Holowasi does a opportunity call every Monday and Wednesday. So there's not really any excuses for you not to be showing, showing up to at least one opportunity call with some potentials because there's one on a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. So you can invite people that, are sh that show interest into the products or the business to these opportunity calls. Now they can be inspired. You know, you don't have to worry about doing the business side of it or talk about the products in too much detail because that's all done for you. You just need to be an inviting machine. Okay. And I think we're going to go on to talk about that in a minute. So we also have local events. So it's really important to get offline and go and actually meet people face to face. Um, so think about, you know, if, where locally to you, is there an event going on? Um, I know the girls in Brighton, they do an event. Up with, we used to do an event together. I'm going to be putting on events here in, um, in Changu. Um, and I know that Amy does an Ipswich event as well. So think about what events that you're going to get to. And if there's not one in your area, just put one on. Just go and sit in a coffee shop, take your products with you and invite people and go and share your story. It's that simple. You don't have to be like, you know, thinking that you're, I don't know, like super clued up about, you know, how to talk about business or products. You could even invite people and sit there and watch the opportunity call with them. That could be an event, you know. Um, and then we've got in-home events so you can invite people around to your house and share the products by doing a shake party, um, shakes and champagne, you know, make some different flavor shakes, talk about the capsules, give them some champagne, you know, make them a bit drunk and then sign them up. It's a really great way to kind of, you know, get people started. <laughs> people are more willing to give their bank details. I'm so joking. Um, kind of, not really. Um, <laughs> um, but it's just nice to have like a little get together. So shakes and champagne is something that really works well. Um, I've got this really cool space I showed you yesterday, but up here. Um, it's like a really cool little area in, in the room that I'm living in right now in Bali. So I'm going to go and get myself a whiteboard and I'm going to be holding events up there. Um, I'm going to get some like little bottles of champagne, make some shakes some smoothies, put some fairy lights up there, put some cushions up there. So just make it really cool, put some music on and, you know, you can see how you can create some ambience and, you know, just have a really nice chilled time. And it's not necessarily about being the most clued up person. It's just about having fun. So think about how you can make it super fun. Um, so, so yeah, you could have shot for shot, like a shot of, um, a shot of shake and then a shot of vodka. I don't know. <laughs> Just do something really fun. Um, yeah. So, so yeah. Anyway, back to the questions. Um, so yeah, what, what events are you going to get to? And the other really important events that you really must, must get to is, uh, the, um, what they called the not international, what are they called, Amy? Regional. <laughs> Oh, the regionals. Yeah. Yeah, the, the regional events. So there's one coming up in November in Edinburgh, which is going to be absolutely incredible. Um, the last ones that we had, the last event that we had was in Brighton, which was absolutely incredible. Like the best event yet by far. It was just incredible. If anyone was there, like give us a wave and, you know, put in the comment what you loved about it. Like it was absolutely mind blowing. Like honestly, guys, every time I go to these events, I'm like, how does this keep getting better? Like the energy in the room, the speakers that what they have, um, it was literally just incredible. Like we had 
of my upline and your guys' upline, Katie Wren flew over from um, Florida. If you don't know her, go follow her on Facebook. She's So basically, she's all of that, your upline as well. So it's Katie, me, Amy, um, or Katie, me, you guys, Tracy and everybody. Um, you know, she's our upline. She was there. She was speaking. She's had an incredible journey. Um, Stephen Bartlett was there. Dave O'Brien, who is a barefoot marathon runner, who's run the four most dangerous marathons in the world. Um, and he thanks Juice Plus for his um, his health. Um, he Yeah, it was amazing. So if you don't know who Dave O'Brien is, go and, go and check him out too. Um, yeah, it was amazing. So good. Love Katie Wren. Oh my God, learned so much. And that's it. Like you go to these events and it's not necessarily about, you know, the people that are on stage. It's about the people that you're with and afterwards and the people that you hang out with and what you can learn and what you can grow. And you might just have that light bulb moment. Um, so, so yeah, events are so important to get to guys. Um, so yeah, that's that. That's the fourth question. And question number five is what self-development are you doing daily? What self-development are you doing daily? So it's really important to be growing. So for your business to grow, you've got to grow in this business. And something that I'm really proud of and something that I absolutely love is, is the personal development journey that I've been on myself. When I first started this business, I was extremely shy. I suffered with social anxiety. Some of you know this, but for newbies, like I had no confidence you know and, and being in the business it's given me um the support system through the team through my upline sidelines to be able to step into my authenticity and actually believe and know that i'm on a mission and you know i, I know my path in life through this business to help people and to serve people whereas before i was a bit you know clueless i didn't really know what i was doing with my life um but it's through self-development through doing you know daily practice of I am statements, gratitude. So you're thinking about um, five to 10 things that I'm grateful for every single day and writing them down. Because when you feel gratitude, you can't feel anger, sadness, anxiety, because the two, you, you physically cannot, your brain can't think those two things at the same time. So anytime you're feeling um, anxious or depressed or angry, just step back and think about what you're really grateful for. Um, you know, whether it's your upline for welcoming you to the business, whether it's, you know, the hands that you've got that you can, that allows you to get dressed in the morning. There are so many things that you can be grateful for daily. Um, and if you pr start practicing that, then, um, you know, your, your life will really change. That's, that's my absolute number one tip. If, if anything you take from this call tonight, be more grateful for everything in life. You know, we are so lucky to be in the position that we are in, to be able to have electricity to bring us onto this call together from all around the world. There, you know, if you earn, I think it's something like if you earn like a hundred pounds a month, you're in the top 95% of the wealthiest people in the world, which is mental, right? That's how much poverty there is. And we've got the opportunity to change people's lives with this business and actually create an above average lifestyle for, for average people. So we're just, we're just normal people guys and we want to live extraordinary lives. So, um, you know, it's, it's a really, really amazing business to be able to give us that opportunity to, to, not have to just settle for a nine to five or settle for a job that gives us a limited pay. Like we can earn as much as we want and we can help as many people as we want all over the world. And that just comes down to you. And actually, you know, the confidence that you have or don't have right now is, is down to the way that you speak to yourself. So the thoughts that go on up here, and that's why gratitude is so important because it helps you build that internal belief muscle. And once you start building that belief muscle, you'll start to have more confidence and you perhaps start to talk to more people. So it's about getting outside your comfort zone, going and talking to more people and just being like, look, I've got something that's really interesting. I've got something that you might be interested in and that could help you. You know, never tell people that you've got something that will change their lives because you never know. Um, you know, you, sometimes you can be that assertive, but sometimes it's a bit assumptive to, to say that. So I really like to say the two magic sentences, I might have something that can help you, or I might have something that you're interested in. They are the two sentences that I have said the most throughout my time in the business that have created the most success for me. Because then people will ask you, well, what is it? Then you can say to them, well, if I add you to a group, because if you're out and about, so there's something called three foot rolling guys. I'm going on a bit of a tangent here, so bear with. There's something called three foot ruling where you can speak to anybody that comes in within three foot of you. And Jeanette Turner is an absolute queen at this. She talks to absolutely everybody wherever she goes. Um, and yeah, it's just incredible the way that she goes out there. She speaks to absolutely anybody that comes in within three foot of her because she knows that she's got something that they might be interested in. She's not assuming that they are, but she's asking, I might have something that you're interested in. 
if I added you to, into a group and tagged you in a video, would you watch it? It's that simple. They can say yes. If they say no, fine, whatever, next, move on. Because you're gonna get some no's guys. No's are, you know, it's a fundamental part of this business. It's just how you deal with it. People aren't saying no to you, they're saying no to the opportunity. And they're actually saying no to themselves. So never be offended when someone says no. And actually, when someone says no, they're just not ready yet. There's so many people that over the six and a half years in this business that have said no and have come back to being on the products and in the business now with me. So never be offended. Just be like, okay, no worries. Maybe speak to you some other time about it. But then never just stop the conversation. Carry on and be like, so, so what are you up to this week? Are you having a nice weekend? Like, you know, because otherwise people are just going to think, well, you just wanted me to sign up to your opportunity. So it's really important to build on that relationship, guys. Um, so yeah, just back to self-development. Um, it's really important because as you can see, through habit, doing self-development, it leads on to so many other things, um, like three foot ruling and having the confidence to do that. So think about what self-development that you're doing. So Ames, do you want to recommend some different kinds of self-development that, that have worked for you um, and what you do kind of daily to help you grow? Yeah, definitely. So um, when I first started, I first start, I didn't even know what personal development was. And then I remember I was at an event, one of the first times I met Millie, and she came up to me and she was like, Ames, I got you a little present. I got you sound to listen on the way home from the event. Here you go. And this is the first thing that I ever received. This is my first ever bit of personal development and it's a CD and I put it in my little Peugeot 106 and I drove home from that event literally in the clouds. I was literally like flying home on cloud nine so it's called Jim Rohn building your network marketing business obviously now you can get it on uh, audible you can get it on um, like so you can buy it through Amazon and then have it on audible on your phone I think it's even on YouTube now for free um, so I'd really really recommend listening to this because this will really help you to kind of understand network marketing which is what this is i didn't even know what network marketing was before i started so when i heard this it just blew me away it helped me understand um like the numbers behind it so a little bit how like Minnie's spoken about um your numbers and getting your nose this will explain more about that um and just help you understand like the industry and what it is that you're doing and the business that you're in which is really really important so i would definitely start off with that um and then like what millie said about your mindset like the secret is amazing um the law of attraction so it's it's um it's an audio that's just called the secret maybe we'll put it in the chat so everyone can see it and that just really gets you to think about you know your thought patterns and gets you to start to think more positively so you can attract more better things into your life um so yeah but mainly the jim Rohn one to start with if you're new um but yeah i've been definitely loving uh, the secret as well there's loads more there's loads of books out there loads of things you can listen to and stuff but keep it simple obviously we've got zoom calls that we have on every week as well so you can get on them their personal development as well and i like millie's like the queenie of personal development mm -hmm. so is there any books that you want to recommend millie or should we just keep um, it with this i'm just putting that in the chat so there's a link to the secret there for youtube guys in the chat Perfect. So anybody that hasn't got it then please click on that link it's free you can also watch it on netflix as well so um goodness me like what do i recommend so I don't really like, I don't want to, there's so many that I could recommend, but what I would yeah. recommend, because what might work for me might not work for you, however, Jim Rohn, Building Your Network Marketing Business is absolutely fundamental for you guys to be able to understand what you're doing, and it's really short, so, um, it's really short, so don't worry about buying it or getting it online and going, God, I don't know if I've got time for this. Just listen to it in your car and you'll hear it. Like, like Tracy said, she listens to it at least once a month and she's been in the business for five years now, I think, maybe six. Um, you know, so it's, it's, it's never, you know, you can just listen to it over and over again. Basically, it doesn't get old and it just refreshes your memory. And we all, we all quote Jim Rohn quotes. Um, you know, so it's because it's, it's part of what we do. It's part of who we are. It's part of the business that we're in. And it's really important to understand it. And Jim Rohn was like a founding father of network marketing, really. And he's somebody that a lot of people look up to. So definitely go and get that in your car. And the thing is as well, guys, when you're doing self-development, you don't have to do it in any extra time. So we call it net. It's no extra time. So when you're laying in the bath, when you're walking to work, when you're driving in your car, that like your car can be a university on wheels. So educate yourself through the time that you've got that's, 
that you're basically driving. So when you're driving, that's what you have to do. So use that time wisely um, and put your CD in your car or have your phone and have one earphone and not two when you're driving because you've got to hear what's going on around you. Um, it's just really important to be using your time wisely. You know, if you are time poor at the moment and you're in this business because you want to break free from that, use the time that you've got really sensibly. Like even when you're in the bath, in the shower, when you're making dinner, put a podcast on, put, um, you know, something on that's going to inspire you. So um, what I would recommend that you do do is go to YouTube or go to um, Amazon and type in personal development, have a scroll through and see what jumps out to you because what jumps out for me might not jump out for you. And the right things with the right words, like buzzwords, you're going to see. So what relates to you might not relate to me and vice versa. So yeah, personal development is absolutely fundamental. So yeah, they are the five questions to ask yourself, um, you know, right now. And if you are just getting started, it's a really good way to kind of figure out where you're going with your business. So um, what we're going to wrap up with for the last 15 minutes, we're going to talk about um, the first couple of positions in your business and um, what we're working towards. So... As a business, guys, we want to think about how to build a business and how to progress through the position. So some of you may know, some of you may not know, throughout the business, there is £78,800 worth of bonuses to pick up along the way, which is absolutely incredible, right? Um, you know, and every single person that has joined this business has exactly the same equal opportunity to get all of those bonuses. It just depends on how many people you speak to and how much effort you put into your business because we're efforts related. So to build a business, the minimum that you should be doing every single month is 825 points plus one teamy. And then what you want to do is with that one team member who might have been a customer that have got great results and you've said, hey, you've got such great results and you've got so many people coming and asking you about your results. Instead of me making money for you by you bringing new customers, why don't you sign up to the business and make yourself a part-time income? That simple. I don't know what that was. Um, so, sorry, that just really threw me. Um, so yeah, so you want to be doing 825 plus one teamy um, every single month. And over the course of seven months, if you do 825 plus one and you duplicate that with your plus one and they duplicate with that plus one, in just seven months, you can get to the pinnacle position of national marketing director, which is crazy. And actually your business might not grow like that. It, you know, it might not duplicate some months and other months you might get three team members that get three team members, but it's all about doing consistent effort and making a consistent goal every single month. So think about 825 plus one every single month. And going back to how do we get customers, it's all about, it starts with you guys. It starts with your product journey and your results because your results equal motivation and inspiration through people. So sharing it like Amy was talking about on your story. So you can see there's a circle. It starts with you, you take your products, you share your products, people see what you're doing, they get on the products, they share their product journey, and then they get in the business and it just circulates. It goes like this and that's what it's all about. So it's really important that you do all of these little um, little tips that we're, we're sharing with you. So, um, so yeah, to grow your business every single month, you need 825 points plus one. So how you get points, Ames, do you want to talk about getting to STD? That's what you're going to talk about, won't you? Okay, I'll pass it. So I'm going to pass you over to Amy now, guys, and she's going to talk about STD. <laughs> So then obviously like Millie, so right, okay. So yeah, SDD is the first position in the business where you get a juicy bonus. So you start to pick up some of this 78,000 pounds of bonuses that are up for grabs. Um, so SDD is like literally like the most important position because it's super exciting. Because if you, when you get to SDD, all it's about is then teaching and helping others to then duplicate that and help them to get to STD as well. And if you do that over and over, this is where you can really start to build an exciting business and really get to like the pinnacle positions and, you know, help people all over the world, which is really, really exciting. And that's the opportunity that we have to do. But also remember that you can choose what you do with your business. So like I say, there's absolutely no pressure. You don't have to go for promotions if you don't want to, but obviously they're there. Some of you might be more uh, ambitious than others, which is absolutely fine. Um, so you can go at your speed, but this is what's kind of available for you. If you want to really go for it and really get off to that fast start, like SDD is definitely a first kind of goal to aim towards if you really want to get off to like an amazing start. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to 
see if I can, I don't know if I can share my screen or not. Um, I don't know, oh, there we go, share. So I've got like a little diagram for you guys just to um, finish off, just to help you understand SDD um, and how to get there. And then obviously how you can then teach this to your teams as well. So just give this a little thumbs up. You can all hear, see this okay? Yeah, awesome. So, um, SDD actually stand, stands for Senior Direct Distributor, so for short it's SDD. Um, so for SDD, um, you need a total of 3,250 points. So points mean prizes. So every time that you um, sell, recommend the products and someone decides to buy with you and they become your customer, you get points for that product that they decide to go with. So, um, just for example here, I've put together the premium capsules and the shakes. Um, so the premium capsules are worth 216 points. Uh, the shakes are worth 144 points. Um, putting those two products together, that makes the, what we call the gold package, which is one of our best um, packages for best results. As we know, the premium capsules are amazing. So, obviously, we've got lots of other different products as well, but just to keep it super simple. I'm just using this as, a, as an example here. So, as you can see on the diagram, I don't know if you guys can see my mouse, but there's you, and you can get three customers. So basically, you get yourself on the gold package because you want to be on. You know, the premium captures are amazing, and you are then going to be able to share that, share that you're using the premium captures and the shakes. You're going to be getting your testimonial and inspiring other people to get on the same as you. So you will then start to say to people, well, I'm on the gold package. This is what I'm feeling. And you'll find that people will want to be what you're on. So you get yourself on the gold package, start sharing your journey, start posting about it and speaking to people. Um, and you get you know, th a minimum of three customers and they get on the gold package as well. Um, then you can get Team A and Team B doing the same thing. So they are going to duplicate exactly what you've done. So they have got themselves on the gold package and then got two customers each. And basically add, adding all that up together, because this is the great thing about building a team guys, is that you can actually accumulate their points towards your promotion of SDD. So their points actually goes towards your three, two, five, oh, which is really, really exciting. Um, you don't have to build a team. Um, you can just, you know, promote and sell the products. But obviously, if you are wanting to, you know, help more people, and it's great because you can actually do this with your family and your friends and get them involved and do it with them, which is really, really fun to, like, do the business together with them. And you'll find that they will know people that you don't even know or they'll inspire people that, um, that, will, relate, that will relate to them. You know, this is what I found when I got my mum involved at the beginning and obviously DJ, my fiance, you know, we all lived in the same house. We were all doing it, but we were all um, inspiring different people because lots of people were relating to us for different reasons. So that's just like a pure example there. So all of those points add up. That's basically 10 customers on the gold package in total. So that adds up to just over 3,250 points. So basically you can do this fast track. So that means you do it in a 30 day period. So one calendar month. So if you do the 3250 on one calendar month, then you get the hundred pound bonus on top of your commissions in month one, which is epic. So you're going to be looking to be getting about four, 500 pounds, including your commissions and your bonus when you do this in month one. Um, and then the following month you can reconfirm and do the same again. And then you get the second part of the bonus in month two, which is £200 bonus on top of your commissions in one calendar month. And again, you're going to be looking to get five, £600 in one calendar month for that, for this promotion, you know, on top of what you're already earning, totally part time, um, which is absolutely epic. So that's just like a really simple way of doing it. Um, with a team, you can do it without a team, but you know, this is just a great example of how you can spread it out and you know, get some of your family and friends involved and have some fun with it as well. So, um, Mills, is there anything else you want to add to that? Yeah, that, that is amazing. It's really great just to keep it really simple. Um, I think, you know, 
don't be don't be scared about what Amy said like it's a really simple system and you know if you think about the grand scheme of things who do you know that wants to look better and feel better um, and a really great way like I mentioned earlier is to find out what people's um, points of kind of um, like pain are if you like so you know what are your top three health goals that's a really good question to ask people um, and then you can ask them um, what what do you struggle with when trying to achieve these goals um, because that way that you can find out the emotional attachment behind that then you can ask them something like how much fruit and vegetables do you eat then you can ask them how much money do you spend per week on the following and you can ask them about junk food so junk food meal deals fast food alcohol because if we want to help people get healthy we can say well for at least 30 days um, would you be willing to cut that out and to, to try a new um, try a new clean eating system to help you feel amazing they'll probably say yes and then you've already got like a lump of money that they've they're not going to be spending on junk food anymore which they can put into their products that's a really great way to get people interested in the products and this can this is actually really simple so as Amy's shown here um, you only need three customers in one month and then if you help your customers get really good results they're gonna to want to tell their friends I've become a teamy or give you referrals and if they become a teamy you can teach that to them it's so so simple and they can go out and do exactly the same so it's a really simple duplicated system and the beautiful thing is you don't need to know a lot of people it's not about knowing 100 or 200 people to be really successful in this business you only need to know five people that's it five people I've got loads of ink on my hands but um, you only need to know five people which sounds crazy but it's true so just have a think about you know who you know that wants to look good feel good make money and then think about you know what your goals are so we know what how to get to STD now and that is the most important part of this business if you can get to STD you can get to the pinnacle position because if you can get to STD you just have to duplicate that over and over again and that'll create success so Guys, thank you so much for coming on here tonight. The last thing that I'm just going to wrap this up with is think about your July goals. What do you want? What do you want to achieve? Um, think about who do you know. Um, think about what it is that you want. What is going to be different? So in one month from now, the time is going to go by anyway. What are you going to commit yourself to? You know, what is it that you really want? Like, because the time, like I said, the time is going to go by anyway. And think about what it is that, um, think about what it is that, would really make a difference to your life even if it's 50 quid a month that's 600 pounds a year guy guys it's it's you know it's it's an incredible amount of money and this business can give you everything that you've ever dreamed and so much more um so really think about what it is that you want and write it down and i challenge you to share it with the team post it in your team groups i think it's really important to be sharing you know exactly what it is that you want and get excited like amy said last night think about you know, who you've got on your Facebook that would also be excited to, to have an opportunity like this. You never know. And the last thing I'll just say is never prejudge. So there's probably people that you know that you're roughly going to never be interested. Actually, sometimes they're the people that end up wanting it the most is the people that you doubt the most. Um, you know, so just never prejudge. Make your list. Write down the people that you know, love and care about that you think that you could help with this business and the products. So there's so much information. Thank you so much for Amy to coming on here. Um, I just wanted to give Charlotte Horner a massive shout out. Um, she's just reconfirmed her second month of SDD. And actually just before we go, I know she's on the call. Um, I'd love you to just to jump on and just to share like three top tips um, of, of getting to SDD, what really worked for you. Um, if you are, I know we spoke about you coming on. Um, Woo, congratulations Charlotte. <laughs> Yeah, hey thank you so much hey. <laughs> i'm literally buzzing <laughs> that's amazing all right i've literally just got home from work <laughs> um listen do you just want to give the guys three top tips of you know what what helped you get to std so my three top tips are i mean i run a full-time job as well as work my business but every minute i get i'm constantly messaging people liking posts building relationships um i mean i'm in and out of clients all day long but i'm so dedicated to the business because of my the passion of helping people is unreal so my top tips would be be, uh, be consistent do your dmo facebook lives share your story love the products be the product of the product because 
that's what's done it for me and build that team support your team support your customers and you're going to fly through and do you know what i mean just be there for them be there for your team support them and get them to the top just like you because it's not just about me it's about the girls as well without them i wouldn't have been sdd do you know what i mean absolutely i love it like <laughs> your passion is i'm so proud of you like wow like when you start this business you know you're a very different person you know with your health and yeah. so like you said being product of the product is absolutely key and it's all about team you know together we achieve more right together everyone. exactly exactly i mean without the team i mean just being in the groups chatting with them every day they're not just the team members and my work colleagues they're they're my family and to to see them achieve their goals and me achieve mine is absolutely insane and this is the best thing that's ever ever happened to me and without these products i wouldn't be here today do you know what i mean so i love the products like they love me mm -hmm. absolutely absolutely love that well done Shah. you're amazing thank you, you. Love you. Um, so thank you so much everybody for coming on tonight if anyone's got any questions then obviously hit me and amy up or hit your upline up and you know we're here to help we're here to serve we're here to help you get through these positions and you know make yourself a business and what i will say is that whenever you're feeling like something's a struggle it's a chance to learn so whenever you feel like oh my god it's not working or oh my god i can't do this that's just a decision that you've made that you can't because you can do anything and it's all about figuring out how you can make it happen so just think exactly about an opportunity to grow and Shah, you've been an amazing product of that you know like i'd be like charlotte go and do a live video like within the next <laughs> days you'd be like done it <laughs> <laughs> amazing it's all about it's all about what you put out there it's all about how you come across with your business and you know taking the products loving them and you know, just, just being you, just being the real version of you. So, all right, guys, thank you so much. Congratulations, Charlotte. Thank you for coming on. Amy. Thank you. Do you want to add anything to the end of the call? I'll just say, guys, like, just take that next step. Like, wherever you are on your journey, if you've literally just signed up, if you've been involved a little while, like, wherever you are on your journey, just take that next step. You know, it's a bit like you're standing at the bottom of the staircase and you've got the big old staircase above. You know how, I'm, why do I always end up explaining things? I don't know. <laughs> it's like becoming a thing. Oh, I don't even realise I do it. Um, yeah, so you've got like your big staircase. So rather than worrying about like what's at the, you know, halfway up or at the top, just take that first step and then the next step and then the next step. That's all I'll say. Just take that next step after this call. Um, plan your DMO, you know, speak to your upline. That's what they're there to support you with. You know, use the team to help you as well. Tap into the system, tap into the calls that we have on um, and just absolutely smash it and like just step into your greatness and step outside your comfort zone and like just, it's just so exciting to see where this can take you. So um, yeah, I'm really, really excited and like we believe in you all. So you can all absolutely go out there and smash it. It's the 1st of July. It's going to be an amazing month and um, yeah, we believe in you. You can do it. Amazing, absolutely. And last thing, don't forget about the 90 day game plan. Day one of 90 is today. So you've still got time to go and smash your DMO if you haven't done it already and go and do those small things. And it's the small things daily that over time make the big differences. And with that, oh, I'm going to go because otherwise we're going to be here all night <laughs> explaining things. <laughs> Love you all. Night. Have a great month, guys. And we'll see you tomorrow night on the Dream Team Opportunity Call if you're coming on. Love you guys.